Welcome back to the channel. If you've bought a gas or a diesel container anytime recently, I'm sure you're aware of how they just gurgle and take forever to fill up whatever you're trying to fill. Today's video is gonna be a quick demonstration on how you can turn this annoying gurgling into this. Stay tuned. To do this, you're gonna need your gas container, you're gonna need the gas vents that you can get from amazon.com or on eBay, I'll put a link in the description below. You're gonna need a 31 64ths drill bit. I know that's an uncommon size, but this is the bit that's recommended. You can get by with a half inch bit. Uh, it'll just be a little bit bigger than this one, but this is the recommended size. And you're going to need a drill or like I have an impact with a drill adapter. So let's get started. The first thing we wanna do is remove our spout and make sure our container is completely empty. Now we're ready to drill our hole. I've got my 31 64ths bit and I'm gonna drill a hole. It's very important to know that it needs to be above the safe fill level line and I'm gonna avoid drilling into these molded seams. So I think right here is a nice big flat spot. Um, I prefer it over here, but this is rounded. It's gonna be harder to get it on there. So this is above the fill level, so this should be a good spot to drill. All right, let's clean this mess out. And we wanna make sure we get any plastic that may have fallen inside out of the container. Now it might be smart to do the drilling upside down, let gravity work for you. That way some of the plastic will fall outside on the ground instead of inside the container. But I've done several this way and it has not been an issue. Just make sure you get it all out from the inside. Sometimes I'll take an air compressor and blow it out, but usually a few shakes, you'll get it out. Next, we're gonna take our cap and we're gonna press fit it into the hole that we just drilled. Just like that. You can see it's a really, really snug fit with that 31 64ths bit. At this point, we're gonna close our vent and I'm gonna put the spout back on and this gas container is gonna be ready, new and improved. Here's some other ones that I've done. In case you have these style containers, these are good spots for them. And here's another demonstration on vented versus not vented. Here it is again without the vent installed. You can see it just gurgling and gurgling and gurgling. And here it is with the vent installed and open. And that's it. That's all there is to it. It's that easy. So I hope this video saved you guys some frustration with those new containers. If it did, hit that like button and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one.